So let's get right into our Tesla news. Tesla bot shows its power in fascinating and frightening fashion. Also, don't laugh off the Tesla bot. Elon Musk Optimus is the real deal. Tesla shares look at Optimus teamwork on humanoid robot actuators. And Tesla reveals production Optimus bot preliminary specs and price. And more. So let's go. Tesla recently displayed the power of the prowess of the Tesla bot's primary leg actuator in a video as it lifted a half grand piano without any issues. The display is both fascinating and frightening as the Tesla bot project continues to move forward. Tesla shared the video and it was amazing at the AI Day event. Lifting the grand piano is no small task, obviously. However, the display of power and strength by the Tesla bot actuator is nothing more than a testament of the strength and capability of its parts. One of the Tesla bot's two primary leg actuators lift a half ton, that's 500 kilogram concert grand piano. Now, don't get me wrong, this is extremely impressive. However, the ease of the actuator lifting this piano is fascinating and frightening at the same time. While the Tesla bot is likely to become a massive part of the Tesla's business model, the product is still in early phases of development, but is moving along quickly thanks to a rapidly expanding team. Although the Tesla bot is now one year past its initial unveiling, the company released some new updates in late September at the AI Day 2.0 event. However, robotic experts were not impressed with the progress. While others commended Tesla's efforts to develop a humanoid household helper, we already know the Tesla bot is capable of helping with basic level test. As of now, Tesla shared a video of the bot assisting workers in the Fremont factory, which is a great step in the right direction. It shows investors and potential customers that the Tesla bot is more than a breakdancing prank. It's a real thing that could revolutionize households. However, there is also a fine line between supportive and scary. While the bot seems to be an ideal solution for household help, the power alone is something that is just downright frightening. I would be sure to stay on Tesla bot's good side. He certainly doesn't skip leg day. Next up, don't laugh off the Tesla bot. Elon Musk Optimus is the real deal. One commentary mentioned, I saw the humanoid robot firsthand. Sure, Tesla prototypes can't do flips, but the company has the right engineering approach for progress. Non-Tesla experts in robotic AI in CNET spoke at the AI Day event and they were impressed with Optimus, the code name for the Tesla bot. The Tesla engineers had the kind of fire in their bellies that bodies well with the progress, especially when backed with chief executive Elon Musk's vision and Tesla's resources. I haven't worked this hard since grad school, but I love it, said one senior chip designer working on Tesla's dojo technology for training the artificial intelligence systems behind Optimus' ability to navigate rooms and Tesla FSD technology to steer cars. He wasn't authorized to speak to the media, but it's interesting to note, it's not yet clear whether humanoid robots will someday do our shopping or take over from human toilings and production lines as must envision. The controversial and outspoken billionaire estimates it'll be three to five years before the first optimist goes on sale, an eternity in technology world. But if his vision holds true, it could transform the world as profoundly as the automobile or smartphone. We wouldn't be surprised to see it become the primary driver of stock price toward the end of the decade. New Street research analyst Pierre Farago said in a report Monday, imagine Optimus as a startup today. It will be valued at several billions of dollars, maybe even a few tens. Research firm ID Tech X expects spending on service robots to nearly quintuple by 2032 to 70 billion. To be sure, there's a long trip from prototype to products, as AI attendees were reminded when seeing a Tesla Semi and Cybertruck, two vehicles that did miss the shipping dates, but the Tesla Semi is here, as well as the Cybertruck is coming in 2023. So these two vehicles, even though they missed their shipping dates, they're here or right around the corner. While Tesla's ability to deliver on its robot's vision is even more up in the air, I'd recommend against writing this product off merely as a must fantasy, because very soon, it may just be a reality. We can't wait to the next AI day to see even more details unfold. Next up, Tesla shares rare look at Optimus team working on humanoid robot actuators. Tesla has shared pretty rare look on its Optimus team's work on a new video. 
The clip, which features interviews with Optimus team and footage of the humanoid robot custom actuator, hints at the serious work that the electric vehicle maker has been doing for its ambitious project. Tesla CEO Elon Musk has noted that one of the company's most important products is Optimus, since the humanoid robot would be replacing human workers in tasks that are repetitive, dangerous, and boring as we've heard many times. But Tesla surprised many during the AI Day 2022 presentation as the company was able to come up with a couple of impressive prototypes over the past years. Job listings for the Optimus team has been quite abounding on Tesla's career website. The recent video is no different, with Tesla inviting applicants on LinkedIn to join the actuator team. In its post, Tesla noted that the company's Optimus team is the future of robotics. Tesla's work on Optimus is definitely wrapping, and this was hinted by the members of the team that were featured in the recent video. As noted by some members, Tesla's strong vertical integration is actually one of the key advantages enjoyed by the Optimus team, as it allows them to innovate quickly from CAD to reality. While Tesla's humanoid robot is significantly smaller product than the company's electric vehicle, it does present its own set of challenges. As noted by the company, Optimus would have 28 structural actuators that help its body achieve over 200 degrees of freedom. Its hands alone have 11 degrees of freedom, allowing the robot's hands to move similarly to a human's hand. And we know that along with hands, there's action. So Elon Musk has ambitious plans for Tesla humanoid robot with the Tesla CEO noting during the AI Day 2022 that it should be possible to have Optimus delivered starting within the next three to five years. Musk also intended to produce Tesla's humanoid robot in mass, with Optimus being priced at just about or less than $20,000. We'll see about that pricing, but if it is that low, definitely it will shoot up the stock in a great way. Next up, Tesla reveals production Optimus bot tentative specs and price. Well, we already know the price, but what about the specs? At the AI day number two, 2022, the first bot that was actually revealed was the Bumble C. The Optimus bot developed platform was able to walk and dance on stage without human assistance. But while it was impressive, Bumble C is costly since it is made with off-the-shelf components. A second bot, complete with Tesla Texas belt buckle, was closer to the humanoid robot's production version and it's designed to be produced in mass. Optimus builds on everything that Tesla has worked on over the years. As such, it was no surprise that Tesla would be using its own battery tech on the humanoid robot. Optimus will be equipped with a 2.3 kilowatt battery pack, which integrates electronics, which could be perfect for a full day's work. It also consumes about 100 watts of power, sitting down and 500 watts when walking briskly. Such power consumption is actually not that excessive. As noted by CNET, Optimus power consumption is quite similar to a high-end gaming PC. Only this one walks on two legs, does all sort of physical work and weighs 160 pounds. Optimus Brain could tap into Tesla's experience in chip design. Thus, each humanoid robot will have one SOC for connectivity. Optimus will be both Wi-Fi and LTE capable. This could make it fairly simple for Tesla to upgrade and improve Optimus performance over time, similar to the company's all-electric vehicles by means of the Dojo computer. While Optimus is smaller than the company's vehicles, as we know, it will function pretty much the same with full self-driving capabilities, seeing everything from its amazing screen that it's been designed with. So we can't wait till it touches the real world and we're able to put it to work. What do you think about the Tesla bot? Is this something that will come to fruition? Is this something that you hope for? Also, leave any of your Tesla questions below. We would love to hear them. And if you have an electric vehicle, let us know which one you have. Next up, the tweet of the week. Elon Musk considered stepping down from Twitter CEO in a poll. Elon Musk tweeted a poll recently asking Twitter users if he should step down as the head of Twitter. The head of the multiple companies voted that he would abide by the results of the poll. As of this week, the poll revealed that the Twitter user has voted 57.4 versus 42.6 in favor of Elon Musk stepping down as Twitter CEO. Even if he does step down as chief tweet, Elon Musk will still own Twitter. The votes show that 
not many people completely detest the idea of Elon Musk as Twitter CEO. The comments under the poll also reveal mixed thoughts and feelings about Musk as Twitter CEO. Musk has been criticized throughout his entire run as CEO of Twitter. Some of his decisions for the platform have been met with a lot of pushback from Twitter users and the media. Twitter's effect on Tesla stock has also been emphasized. Recently, Twitter suspended the account of several journalists from prominent news agencies. Among the accounts were CNN, Dunn, Sullivan, Ryan Mack from the New York Times, and Drew Harwell from the Washington Post. Must explain, and I quote, As I'm sure anyone who's been doxxed would agree, showing real-time information about somebody's location is inappropriate, and I think anyone on this call would not like that put into them. There's not going to be any distinction in the future between journalists and regular people. End of quote. Twitter recently updated Twitter's privacy info policy. The platform issued the update after info from a jet tracker account, which tweeted live information on celebrities, led to an incident with Baby X, Elon Musk's youngest son. Twitter banned the jet tracker account owner and decided to suspend any accounts doxing real-time locations info on anyone. Some Twitter users might view the update to Twitter's privacy info policy and the subsequent suspension of the journalist's account as contradicting Musk's initial plan for the platform. He wanted Twitter to truly support freedom of speech. However, tweeting people's live location can lead to dangerous circumstances for any citizen, private or public. In addition, some argue that celebrities, politicians, and other public figures have a right to safety and privacy. So we wanted to put you up to date with all of these latest news from the Tesla space as well as Twitter. Do you think that Elon Musk should step down from Twitter as a CEO? Do you believe there's consequences to freedom of speech that people need to consider? We'd like to hear from you and we'll catch up with you very soon on the next one. Click the link and subscribe because we have those fire updates on Watts Lock and Key. You are watching Watts Lock and Key.